Big time shit, time to feel the rest. Yes, I must pay, so the price is just to live. But you think the fish printed the shit about me? The rich beats off the poor, and still you clear America's break. Rather eradicate this governmental disease. So vote or don't vote, it won't fucking matter. The poor will still die, and politicians' pocketbooks will still get fatter. I admit it. I'm in this to better the world. I believe in the good inside of us all. But I'm also intelligent enough to realize the people hearing my words are of a small size. So tell me, is this really more than music? It's so that get out in the street, talk to your neighbor and people at the grocery store. Tell them your thoughts and listen to theirs. Our movement is a failure because we don't communicate. Just drink alcohol and write silly slogans like smash the state. To change the world is hard work. You gotta unify and use your minds and hearts. A music scene is worthless when too many it excludes. Apathy and ignorance set the mood. Break outside the confines of the music scene and together with real people make reality out of dreams. Fuck off, Christian whore. It's all about why I can't. 
world with our rest. If all you had to see is Satan Blood and Door, then just shut the fuck up! Head up your ass. Most are content to be unaware. Got your head so far up your ass, you can't breathe. You say the cover is sus, but do nothing. I may do little, but at least it's something. Fuck off, sexist scum. You still don't understand, do you? I've been screaming till my face turns blue. Women are not your dolls for you to fuck. And if you think you're superior, you suck. Legalization. Legalize abortion. Set. <laughs> Fuck. Ain't fucking hot in here. This, this next song's called Don't Be Afraid. <laughs> Alright. Well, everyone. Sooner or later, in their lifetime, we'll meet a hypocrite. And this next song goes out to those bat-stabbing assholes. Those ones that will tell you, yeah, I believe in what you do. And then, <laughs> they'll stab you right in the back. They'll contradict their own words. Okay, this song goes out to all those low like fuckheads. It's called Hypocrite. I tell you what I think and feel. I thought you were a friend, true and real. But then I realized you patronized and kind of send me. Hypocrite and liar, stay the fuck away from me. All right, this next song is about alternative. Now, a short history lesson. Alternative started as, I know it's going to sound stupid and very obvious. Alternative was music that was an alternative to mainstream music but now alternative has become mainstream is it an alternative anymore so whatever alternative fucking sucks there is no alternative this song's called alternative Think for yourself.
right, Sonny's needs no, in no introduction. This one's called Food Not Bombs. Yeah, the government wants national security. But to me, I think they're all bordering that senility. The money we spent on weapons in one lousy week for feeding the whole world for a whole year. So fuck these fascist scrooges. Feed the homeless, not the war machine. All right. <laughs> All right, that song goes out to my good friend Eric Disorder. It's dedicated to him. Fucking noise freak that you are. This one's called Rebla. Alright, well, we all heard so much shit about sellout bands, and well, here's my little song about it. I do think that there are more important issues to discuss, but, hey, I'm a big mouth asshole, so I'll sing my song about sellout bands. This one's called Extreme Noise Capitalism. But all you really care about is dollars. You speed the face of our movement. You call yourselves underground. Alright, this next song is about eating meat. And really, what I want to do is um, not preach to you, but I really want you to think about your eating habits. Because. You are not the only person in the facts. Think about it. This one's called it's your it's your choice. Whether you eat meat or not, it's your choice. But you must consider the animals who have no voice. You must consider that the meat industry is the number one polluter of our air and seas. You must consider the fact that humans are herbivores. Our intestines are much larger than those of carnivores. And by the time our meat goes through it, it's rotten and decayed. And our teeth are made for eating plants. And I won't even mention high blood pressure and cancer. So if you ask me, here's my answer. But it's your choice. Just another song? I'm gonna devil for the same old songs. Screw me against the world so fucking wrong. Maybe you're sick of hearing what I say, but I'm sick of happy, so fuck off, asshole. Alright, this next song is about a very touchy subject. You know, we all know uh, about women that um, self induce vomiting so they can stay thin. Well, this is a, this is a big problem, and I think one that more people should think about while well, the song's called It's Not Right. To fed the image, to stay healthy and trim, some of you bobbing up your all your meals. It's not right. The man says to me to play. I could never understand how you feel. Alright, this next song is called Child Pornography is Shit. As a lady, we've been seeing a lot of that on the internet and shit, and I don't care where it's from, the internet, in magazines, videos, this fucking shit has to change. How can you hurt little children like that? I don't know. You're fucking sick. This one's called Child Pornography is, sh is Shit. Why does fear grip the world? 
what the fuck is up with all this violence? There's someone like me, it don't make any sense. Everyone seems to be afraid, so they lash out. But I just wonder what's it all about. Wait till you get Garrett, he's fear to keep us alive. And if you step out of line, you'll become the enemy. There's no reason to fear one another. I think they think the fear is big brother. Major labels suck. Oh, fuck off. Oh, you greedy capitalistic bastards. Try to exploit the scene for your own benefits. You promised to ban proper distribution and promotion, but your links to weapon countries, companies is the real shit. When a band signs to a major record label, they are signing away their artistic freedom. So I say keep this music underground, just we refuse to be a part of your system. Alright, this song, uh, this is a silly little song. Sort of auto by it. Sort of like an autobiography. Ah, outcast of society. Ah. serious tune here um it's about racism and about the hatred that we have for one or just based on a simple thing like the skin color what can i say it's stupid it's useless and all of us really gotta do more to combat this shit get involved uh, there's there's an there's anti-racist action groups all over the united states and canada uh if you need an address for one close to you, just write to me and I'll send you an address for the one closest to you or whatever. It's time to get involved. Do whatever it takes. This one's called The Never Ending Curse. Racism, it just never ends. Why do you hate one or I can't understand? Don't judge a book by the car, don't follow the plan, a big brother. Just you see the system wants us divided. That way we can't have a revolution. So stop hating, cause it's getting clear, and drag your hate against this bullshit system. Alright, this song is basically called Words on a Lyric Sheet. That's the title of the song, and this one is about how people often get brainwashed by a band's lyrics with, without really thinking or researching the issues discussed on the record or the tape. Things I talk about, I think you should really find out for yourself the truth. And I think you should think about it and form your own opinions. Not necessarily mine, but your own. Basically, I think people should think for themselves more and not let bands or artists decide for them what they think about certain issues. Okay, this one's called Words on a Lyric Sheet. One, two, three, let's go. Are you really that stupid? Homophobic, racist, sexist, fascist. Capitalistic, free, hypocritical. That song's called Negative. You ask me why I'm so negative. I'm against everything. I'm not for anything, but there's one thing I am for, 
and for the revolution to destroy this system. I can't see a note. Fuck you! Alright, fuckheads. Okay. Well, you probably won't understand this song, but this one's called What Happened to Me. Alright, this song goes out to all people into noise tour and crying noise. It's called No More Songs. This one called Death Metal Bores Me. Alright, this has songs about the homeless and about squatters. It's called Give Them a Home. Here in the States, we got a homeless problem. Well, over there are thousands of our use of bad bills. So I say, we got a squatter and those are bad bills. Alright, no more labels. No more labels. Alright, the test songs about the stress and anxiety you go through at work. Um, this song is called Stress Out. This is this is our last song. This is my last song. It's called "What to Write." I feel uninspired. Don't know what to say. This is just a song to fill space that I take. Alright, thanks for listening. Thanks to everybody that actually likes this band and supports me. It's over.